Today is Sunday, October 27th, 2024, and the title of this message is Peace Which Surpasses All Understanding. Philippians 4, 6 through 9 says, Do not fret or have any anxiety about anything. But in every circumstance and in everything, by prayer and petition, definite requests with thanksgiving, continue to make your wants known to God. And God's peace shall be yours, that tranquil state of a soul assured of its salvation through Christ. And so fearing nothing from God and being content with its earthly lot of whatever sort that is, that peace which transcends all understanding, shall garrison and mount guard over your hearts and minds in Christ Jesus. For the rest, brethren, whatever is true, whatever is worthy of reverence and is honorable and seemly, whatever is just, Whatever is pure, whatever is lovely and lovable, whatever is kind and winsome and gracious, if there is any virtue and excellence, if there is anything worthy of praise, think on and weigh and take account of these things. Fix your minds on them. The peace that surpasses all understanding I have experienced that peace. I have experienced the peace that surpasses all understanding. What a blessing to know the peace that surpasses all understanding. What a miracle to experience the peace that surpasses all understanding. What a true gift to possess the peace that surpasses all understanding. It is such a miracle to one minute be crying out to God on your knees, tears flowing, heartache, and then miraculously feel a peace and a calm come over you, feel a healing come over you that is almost incomprehensible. And what even more of a miracle when others can witness it, when others can testify to seeing a person one minute down on the ground, the next minute up on their feet, praising God, shouting hallelujah. Finally, the peace has come. Finally, the chains have broken. This beautiful, miraculous, light-hearted peace Soul feeding peace, spirit nurturing peace, glorious peace, comforting peace, renewing peace, strengthening peace, the peace that surpasses all understanding. What a beautiful feeling. What a beautiful gift. I can testify that my greatest peace comes in obedience. My greatest peace comes in simplicity. My greatest peace comes when I sit with God, when I meditate on the word, when I do my Bible study. So many times when I sat down and I studied the Bible and I had my window open and I looked up into the beautiful clear sky and I saw the birds and the sun was shining. There was this beautiful peace sitting with that word, feeling the spirit of God washing over me. 
feeling cleansed in my spirit, feeling renewed in my spirit, being filled with that peace. What a beautiful thing. The peace that surpasses all understanding. A peace so great that it doesn't matter what else is going on around you. You still have peace. It doesn't matter what chaos is forming in the world. You still have peace. It doesn't matter how many trials try to fall at your feet. You still have peace. It doesn't matter how many mountains, how many mountains, how many mountains of tribulation try to form around you. You still have peace. The peace that surpasses all understanding. Philippians 4, 6 through 9. Do not fret or have any anxiety about anything, but in every circumstance and in everything, by prayer and petition, definite request with thanksgiving, continue to make your wants known to God. And God's peace shall be yours. That tranquil state of a soul assured of its salvation through Christ. And so fearing nothing from God and being content with its earthly lot of whatever sort that is. That peace which transcends all understanding shall garrison and mount guard over your hearts and minds in Christ Jesus. For the rest, brethren, whatever is true, whatever is worthy of reverence and is honorable and seemly, whatever is just, whatever is pure, whatever is lovely and lovable, whatever is kind and winsome and gracious, if there is any virtue and excellence, if there is anything worthy of praise, think on and weigh and take account of these things. Fix your minds on them. Practice what you have learned and received and heard and seen in me and model your way of living on it. And the God of peace, of untroubled, undisturbed, well-being will be with you the peace that surpasses all understanding when you have the peace that surpasses all understanding you don't care about keeping up with the joneses when you have a peace that surpasses all understanding you're so thankful you're so grateful you're giving thanksgiving you're thanking god you're thanking god for your circumstance you're thanking God for your situation. You're thanking God for what you have. You are thankful for a roof over your head. You are thankful for food in your body. You are thankful for whatever challenges that are coming to grow you and stretch you and build you up. When you have a peace that surpasses all understanding, you see the cup is half full. When you have a peace that surpasses all understanding, you're not looking at the problems. You're getting those solutions. You're finding those solutions. You're becoming the solution. When you have a peace that surpasses all understanding, you are a light in the darkness. When you have a peace that surpasses all understanding, you have God on your side. The living God is with you when you have a peace that surpasses all understanding. It is because of the living God that you have a peace that surpasses all understanding. It is not an earthly thing. It is not a mortal thing. It is a supernatural thing. The peace that surpasses all understanding. Many people can't comprehend it. Many people can't comprehend it. Many people can't comprehend it. It's the peace that surpasses all understanding. What a beautiful gift from God. It requires for you to be thankful. It requires for you to have a relationship with God. It requires for you to ask God. The word says to ask and you shall receive. Ask God for the peace that surpasses all understanding. Ask God for peace. 
Ask God for peace. Ask God for peace in your trouble. Ask God for peace in your circumstance. Ask God for peace in your situation. The peace that surpasses all understanding. The peace that surpasses all understanding. What a beautiful gift. What a miraculous gift. What a wonderful gift. The peace that surpasses all understanding. I feel the most peace when I'm constantly in fellowship with God. I feel the most peace. When I take that quiet time, the more time I'm in nature, the more time I'm getting fresh air, the more time I feel the sunlight, that beautiful peace, being in the midst of God's beautiful creation, the peace that surpasses all understanding. When you eat right, when you're drinking your water, when you're not clogging and cluttering up your body, when you are fasting, there's a miracle that produces a peace that surpasses all understanding. 